don't mess with Sarah Almadani. In an exclusive interview with TFACTS's Virtuality podcast, The Real Housewives of Dubai star opens up about her shocking breakup with Akin Fontana, whom she describes as thirsty for fame. Sarah candidly discusses how she felt a disconnect between Fontana's public persona and his true character. There's a problem when the exterior don't match the interior, right? And there's a problem when there's a grown man so thirsty for fame. She explains, revealing how she realized his real motives months into their relationship. She recalls a moment during filming when Fontana, after returning to Germany, insisted on coming back for more, but she was adamant that their time together had ended. How dare you take me off the show? How dare you? He reportedly exclaimed, to which she responded, I'm confused. Sarah has kept messages and receipts from their exchanges, emphasizing the controlling behavior Fontana exhibited during their romance. The mother of one, who has been open about her desire to remarry, noted that Fontana was eager to rush into marriage just two months after they met. To be honest, he was rushing to get married after two months of meeting each other, she says, clarifying that her future goals of marriage didn't mean she wanted to marry him specifically. Sarah expresses her frustrations about Fontana's controlling tendencies, including his demands regarding her gym habits. He told me that I could not go to a gym that has men in it, she recalls, pointing out the hypocrisy as he is a trainer who works with women. Amid the tension, she hired a private investigator to look into his behavior, sharing how Fontana would often accuse her of infidelity, which she believes stemmed from his own actions. The only person who would do this is a person who's doing that, she states confidently, hinting that she uncovered incriminating evidence which she is not ready to disclose. Sarah has since formed a connection with Fontana's exes, saying, I'm in a WhatsApp group with all your exes and they're freaking awesome and I love them. She teases that she has receipts regarding their experiences with him, leaving the door open for a possible reveal in the future. When asked about her look on love following the breakup, Sarah remains optimistic. Love is beautiful, she asserts. There's eight billion people in the world. You think Aiken or any of my exes are going to ruin that for me? No way. Stay tuned to The Real Housewives of Dubai, airing Tuesdays at 9 p.m. ET on Bravo, as these unfolding dramas promise plenty of excitement.